What's poppin' YouTube? It's your boy Tsunami Timo back at it again with a new review of some products that I use. What I started with and what I use now. So what I started with first was this, okay? Curl Enhancing Smoothie. Um, I use this so much, man. I used, I put a whole glob on my head. My hair was looking white by the time I got done putting it on. So, um, this, for sure, get this. So, um, then what I bought was this, castor oil. This stuff's awesome. It's uh, a little thick, but not as thick as the Jamaican castor oil. So, here, check it out. Uh, it's a few bucks. It says it uh, helps growth and maintain, uh, maintains your hair with oils. Awesome stuff. I use that to this day. My main secret, this stuff right here, this is a killer. I've been using this for so many years. Uh, a barber put me onto this. Um, it's pretty much something they put on your hair every time. When I used to be in the military, the barber used to spray my hair after every haircut. I love this stuff. It smells good. It's oil sheen. Proline oil sheen. You can get this at any store. I use this every day. Uh, if I don't want to put in any curl enhancing smoothie, if I don't want to put any butter into my hair, uh, I mean milk or any kind of other products that have those substances in it, I just put this in there. Okay? It gives it a nice shine all around my hair. So, uh, another thing, I went out and bought these two items, okay? Coconut cream shampoo and coconut cream conditioner. This I use first. I lather my head up, uh, hot water, medium hot water, whatever, rinse it out. You, obviously, I use the brush, brush in the shampoo. Then I turn the water on cold and uh, I use this stuff. And then I, um, I let both of them sit in there for at least five to ten minutes while I'm showering. Um, you can get you one of these. I actually got like a hundred of these from China. They were real cheap um, shower caps. So you don't get your do-rag wet while you're in the shower. Or, for instance, when you're letting the shampoo and the conditioner sit in your hair, you're not going to get it wet. And when you get ready to wash it out, you can take this off, okay? So, um, I also recently got this comb. This comb is a lifesaver, man. I love this comb. It got two sides to it and the little bristles on the inside. I got it at Sally's, a few dollars. It's a great comb. It gets the job done. So, anyways, let's move on to the next product. I actually bought this because I've used this plenty of times in the past. It's a pomade. It's sporting waves. Um, you can get this at Walmart. It's uh, pretty much one of the main things that I use when it comes to pomades. Uh, another thing, uh, it's another pomade that I first originally came uh, to the store and bought. Um, I really don't like this. It's a little bit too thick, so I stopped using this. Um, Murray's. Oh, my Lord. Murray's. A lot of people use Murray's, but I feel like when I put it on my hair, it just is too thick. It lays all my waves down, so I stopped using this. Um, if you want to use it, go ahead, but I don't. I stopped using this. Um, another thing, I bought this when I first started. I rarely use this. It says it helps with frizz. It got olive oil and argan oil in it. So um, I tried to use this a few times. Not a fan, but yeah, I mean you could try it out. It might work for you. It doesn't work for me. So let's move on. I got this. Uh, it's called uh, spritz. I put this on my hairline before I do a cut to keep my hair laid down and in position so I don't mess up my lineup or my edge up, whatever you want to call it, um, while I'm cutting. Because if you don't put this or any kind of uh, a holding uh, agent into your, in the front of your hair, your hairline may shift while you're cutting and then you're not going to get the result that you want. So basically spritz. You can get this at Amazon. It's not expensive. 
So uh, check that out. Then another thing, I, I absolutely love this stuff right here. It's called Super Grow. I got this initially from Walmart um, a long time ago, even before I started waving. Um, what it is, um, it basically helps my hair grow. My hair grows like friggin' weeds on the outside of the house. So like, when I put this in, it just a couple weeks and my hair will be a bush. I mean, my hair is already pretty long right now. So if you're starting to wave, and you're not seeing any progress and you have hair texture like mine, you're gonna wanna um, grow your hair out a little bit longer. At least um, maybe a four or five um, until you're gonna see any results. So keep, keep up the good work. Keep doing what you're doing. Brush every day. Like I said before, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And um, you will get the results that you're looking for. Um, now, I'm going to show you guys this product I bought. I really shouldn't have bought it because it was super expensive. And, um, man, I put, I put a little bit of this in my hair, bro. It was so damn thick. I had to wash my hair after only like two hours of having it in there. But it might, mean, it might work for you. So, this is what it is right here. It's a uh, black castor oil. This stuff is super thick. I really don't like it. I probably shouldn't have bought it, but hey, I'm trying everything out. I'm trying a, a bunch of uh, products out because, as I said before, with the waving, I'm new to it, just like you guys or the subscribers that are new. Um, I'm just in the trial phase, and I got a, um, a few partners in the game that are helping me out, um, picking out some of the products, but you have to know how to use them, like. Don't put everything that I just showed you into your hair at once. It's going to look like a carpet on your damn head. So right now, what I, all I have in my hair is this, like I said. Right here, right here this stuff. I love this stuff. Because it gives it a nice shine. It keeps your hair from drying out. Well, if your hair dries out, put some more. But basically, it keeps you from putting too many layers of product in your hair. And... Uh, I love it, like I said. So let's get in a little brush session, you know, motivation. Let's get it, get your brush out. And like I said, never forget to comb. Combing is always important. A lot of people think that only brushing will do the trick, but I mean, combing is a vital part of waving. So you're gonna wanna get you a comb, a couple combs, different combs. I got multiple combs. I got this comb, I got that comb, I got another comb in, in my bedroom. So I just keep them around, you know? They each do a different job, so I like to keep them, keep a lot of them. You know what I mean? So it's up to you. But if you want to get uh, results, you're gonna want to comb just about as much as you brush. Okay. So and then when you brush or you comb, you're gonna want to end everything with a soft brush. Very important. It'll lay everything down for you, and uh, you'll be done. Once you use this brush, this is a medium. I use this, and I use my other Torino Pro, and I use my ground quality brushes. They're all different uh, uh, bristle types on it, so this one's medium. I got a medium hard. I got a medium soft. I got a soft brush. I got an extra hard, a hard brush. One for each time, each way my hair is. So like if my hair gets much longer than this, I may need to use the hard. But at the length that I have it at right now, uh, I'm just gonna use this brush for now until I get done with this brush session. And then uh, 
I'm probably going to comb again, and then um, I'm going to use the soft brush. Um, I hope it was uh, helpful. Um, some of the products that I use, uh, I hope it helped you out. Uh, the subscriber that asked in the comment section recently, um, and uh, keep up your brushing, man. Don't give up. If you're not getting any results, just keep brushing. Like that's that's the most important part. Like brushing and combing, brushing and combing. That's what you want to do. Goes up. And don't and don't buy into all the the haters out here, man. I'm telling you, like you wouldn't believe how many people think. Uh, that you can't get ways or they'll talk about you. Forget them, man. Just put in the work. Stay consistent. And don't give up, man. As much time as you want to invest into this is what you're going to get out of it. So, just like anything in life, like if you put your put your time towards it, you can achieve it, so. I'm gonna also put all the products that I use, the name, and where to get them in the, uh, in the description below. Uh, check out my Instagram, Tsunami Timo, and like I always say, like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, and hit me in the comment section with something that you want me to do uh, in some of my next videos, okay? Alright, man. Tsunami Timo. And I'm out.